What's good, snackheads? I'm in Pittsburgh airport right now. Um, supposed to be uh, featuring for the Hodge Twins tonight at the Pittsburgh Improv. Um, I'm at the airport. They got the, they got you know, basic uh, food spots. And um, I was walking by before I went to the bathroom. I was walking by and I seen the. Oh, here it is, right here. I came across this. Never seen this before. You know your boy Snackhead. I gotta do it. Oh, my gosh! I forgot my galoshes. Take these off. Um, look at this. Cream. Look at that. Almond cream and mint julep. Never seen that before. That's crazy. So you know your boy gotta get it. So I got them from Nicholas Coffee Shop. Bam and bam. So guys, it came up to um, 358. So yeah, they were like 179 each. 358. Um, that's really cheap, especially at an airport. You would think this would be like four dollars. If it was New York City, like LaGuardia of JFK, man, it's probably would have been like six dollars each. It's crazy. So mega cheap. And that's what's up. Um, yo, so yeah, man, this is it. Look at look at that. Two sodas that I've never seen before. Wouldn't even think that they'll make a julep mint and an almond and cream soda. Now you know I'm all about the almond milk, the coconut milk. Yeah man, this, this is what it is. You boys see snacks, man. Let's crack it open. Plantation style. Julep mint. Plantation, what would they call it? Plantation, what? Red Ribbon. Established since 1904, man. So does that work. This was up. Alright, let's uh let's try the julep mint first, man. I don't got much to talk about just to taste it, man. It is what it is. Now, you already know guys, I'm not really a soda drinker, but I gotta I have to try this man. Julep mint? Does this sound like some perfume that your grandmother would wear or something? I don't know. Julep mint. Alright man, I like to taste it. Here it go. Smells good. Wow. Yo. This tastes like like some morning mouthwash. <laughs> you know the no fills frill uh, mouthwash that's this color that they got at like CVS or like Walmart, like the the traveling ones that they be having in the bin for like a dollar. This tastes like mouthwash. <laughs> Yo, it tastes like mouthwash, like sweet and good mouthwash. That's, oh my gosh. I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but this is actually banging. Yo, this tastes so good. Like, I'm enjoying mouthwash. Mm. I gotta say, you drinking this? This right here, man, I have, they, they, they should sell this at a bar and have this with liquor. This will make your breath smell good. This is, this is mouthwash. What? And it's good. It almost tastes like one of them gums, like a, like an extra. Those little uh, spearmint gums, extra, it tastes, kind of tastes like that. Like I'm drinking extra gum slash mouthwash. <laughs> <laughs> this is some good ass mouthwash. All right, man. Um, this is banging. I can't front. I will buy this. One seventy nine. You can't beat that. One seventy nine. Yeah, I, I will definitely buy that again. Um, let's try the almond cream soda. Uh, I'm more afraid of drinking this. Some almond soda. I'll do the milk all day and, and the almond itself, but soda. Man, can't judge it by looking at it. I like to taste it. Here it go. Wow. 
wow, this is pretty good. This, it, it, I don't taste any almond at all. It tastes more of the cream soda. You know, that cream soda has that distinct flavor, like that and root beer. Like, if you have that, that'll overpower anything with root beer. It tastes like cream soda. I don't taste the almond in it. I don't taste it at all. Yeah. It just tastes like cream soda. Yeah. I'm looking for that almond, that strong almond flavor, and it's not in here. It's just straight up cream soda, man. It's not bad, though. The julep mint, what I thought was going to be nasty. No, actually, I thought the almond was going to be nasty. But the julep mint banging. This right here just tastes just like cream soda, man. It's, it's your boy C-Snacks, man. Peace.